but we'll see what he does. Now the last PT put on an amazing show for PT. We'll see if that can if that trend can stay. Let's see. Mario's really Mario's playing it slow. Although the Squirtle is not. Seems to be a theme with the PTs. Although he's playing it a bit safer than our last PT. How much does he get off the down throw? That's a good little percent. He's at he's still at zero. First hit. Nair doesn't quite hit. Trades with Dare. Down tilts are amazing. Miss the down smash. Up throw, clap doesn't hit. Using the iframes. Doesn't quite kill. Mario's at 116. Mario's at kill percent. Although PT hasn't taken much damage at all. Here comes the fire, neutral B. And the kill with forward air. Yup. He said you have no other choice but to jump. You're not rolling. And you can drop down, but you're just going to get hit. So jump, and then he read him with forward air. And this Squirtle is just racking up so much damage. A lot of talented Squirtles out here. I mean, you got to remember, you're playing three different characters. But their knowledge and their understanding of how to combo and the reading the DI on some of these hits to get these combos to keep going. Wario's really struggling. That was a good F-Tilt. Grabs ledge. Oh, he doesn't hold shield long enough. Now we're trying to see who wins the... Oh, he won the neutral interaction. Back air doesn't hit. The roll gets him out. He got the throw. Forward throw. Down smash not quite hitting against the Ivysaur. What's Ivysaur's plan? He's going to throw Razor Leaf. F smash hits. I thought he was charging up smash. I'm not even going to blame the Wario for getting hit by that. I would have gotten hit by it too. Down tilt to F. Down tilt to dash attack. Combo I haven't seen very often, but yeah, it works. It was a confirm. Let's see if Wario can bring it back. He's got a full he's a full stock down and some change. But he's working on his win con. Did that kill? Not quite. The Waft is not quite able to take it. Good parry. The back air. What's he gonna do? Hanging at ledge. The roll from ledge. Oh, he hit him, but I don't think he was ready for it. Wario's doing his best to keep this spacing alive and do his damage while not getting hit in return. He really can't afford to be doing things like that. He's going to throw the bug. Neutral getup gets through it, though. Back air kills. We have a pretty even game in our hands, ladies and gentlemen. It's only 60%. Wario can make that back off of a very good combo. He just needs to get in there and get that hit. There's Nair. It gets shielded. Nair hits. Up air. Up air. He's clapping his hands, just waiting for this man. And now you look. The percent's almost even. After all of that, off that struggle, Wario really showing why Wario is as good as he is. The raw back air, what does it hit? He went off stage to, ooh, that could have been a spicy down air. Doesn't quite hit though. The up he does. Both players at 90. He's going to Char he's going to Charizard. Charizard is the heaviest character in the set. How does he? Get, what's he gonna do with it though? F till hits. Both almost feel like they're at kill percent. Wario up B at ledge, he jumps, he j lands the grab. Downer doesn't quite hit, he actually trades, he has to use the bike. What's the plan? Get up attack, both at 132. What are we gonna do here? Misses the up smash, but F tilt's gonna take it? F tilt kills! BD Bean really, really learning how the matchup works after. He lost those two stocks and said, alright, that's it. You've played your game, now it's my turn to win. He really said, it's my turn to play on the Xbox. Just denied the PT everything he wanted. I mean, yeah, he was taking those straight hits, but he was really, really came through in the end. That down tilt to dash attack really set the tone for how he's going to play the rest of these stocks out. Let's see, keeping it up. I, I would remain just as confident in the PT as I was before. Noku showed us amazing gameplay with that Squirtle and Ivysaur. But these combos can't... These combos are going big. Ooh, he tried to grab him on neutral getup, but he rolled. Played patient at ledge. It's a very good... It's a very good sign for a player to be patient in those moments. Because those are the moments you have to think the most. You have to understand what they want to do and really use your iframes to get out of those bad places. The up tilt not quite hitting. The down smash does. Razor Leaf not hitting. Read the jump with Nair. We're going to see a down air? Doesn't quite hit, though. Fair. Back air, the good Rars. 
can't quite let these hits to land. Ooh. Missed the tech on the upbeat from Wario. He teched it. Wow. Flare Blitz not quite hitting. Does it kill in the down air? Yes, it does. Off stage. That's why Flare Blitz, you got to be careful when you use it. It's a high commitment move. You got a lot of end lag on it. And these combos come back. There's, that's the Wario Classic. Already at 50%. Both players playing it really patiently at ledge, waiting for their individual moments and when they need to be there. Wario's getting really, really good recoveries with that with the bike. He's getting these the forward airs, really, really good zoning tools. The back airs aren't quite hitting though, but these trades at ledge with Wario's up B, they are really, really winning Wario these interactions. And we're seeing a very different game from what we saw not too long ago with the PT and the Wario. Wario showing a very convincing first stock. He has him at 110 while well, he's at zero. Almost a full stock lead. Forward throw. What do we got now? F tilt not quite hitting. The down smash does. Dash attack not, or get up attack not quite hitting. There goes the bike. Wario really gets to run his offense however he wants. The up smash was great though. He knew he would land on the platform and tech it. He read the tech. Waft didn't hit because he swapped Pokemon. That was a very good split second decision from the PT. Noku's really showing his knowledge. BD Bean's not one to slack, though. He really is putting this pressure on, not letting him breathe. He's very aggressive off stage, and I really like to see it because we didn't really see much real aggression off stage until, you know, these last two games with these down airs from the Ivysaur and Wario really denying him ledge. You now he's going off stage with these big buttons, and he's getting it. The down smash doesn't kill, but the down air will! And he takes game two. Wow. The Wario really, he, had, he just had to warm up for those first two stocks.